is we're just gonna clean up this trim. We're gonna re-black it and uh, get it looking right. So everything matches with the uh, doors, the handle, the trim, and everything will be uh, done. And we're also gonna do the grill. So we're gonna tape that off and re-black the grill. And let's get started. And bingo, a little improvising and it's taped up and ready for paint. So, let's get to it. And last but not least, we're going to do the grill and get it all cleaned up and looking nice. And presto, all taped up. I'm gonna check my edges before I start spraying this and let me get to it. Finished product. Not too bad. Once it dries, I'm going to take the tape off and see what we got. Running out of light, but that is a vast improvement. Looks almost brand new. And as for the grill, it came out pretty good. Uh, I'm not looking for perfection, but um, I just wanted it to be in the realm of the color black. And also got to get a new badge. So I'm going to be ordering that for Mitsubishi. A um, couple of things they may still have in stock. Also, uh, we're going to put this in right now. And if you look here, it has little tabs. All right, there's a tab there, up here, here, and I'm missing one here, and over here. Oh, that one fell out. Alrighty. I have more of these tabs just in case I lose any, so it's not a big deal. There you have it all done. And next what we're going to do is we're going to do tire lettering. Some people like it, some people don't. I think it looks pretty interesting. So first thing we're going to do is wash the car. So we will be back with that.
sick a couple days ago, so I'm taking over permanently. Today, we did the tiring lettering. He picked up these Sharpie paint pens. They're oil-based off of eBay. There was a pack of three. I think he paid like $7 for them. And he said that they came in white or yellow. And I know that you could pick these up in stores as well, but we haven't been able to find them, so we ordered them online. So what we did was painted the front letterings and the ones right across the way. Overall, it did okay. It did a lot of like dabbing and pushing to get the paint to come out we went over the letterings about two two to three times it smeared a lot but in the end far away it doesn't look too bad so here's the before shot of the tirings before the paint and after shot to thank you once again for joining us on another episode of Legion Elite Motorsports. Make sure that you follow, like, and subscribe. Thank you. Alright, got a package for the Mirage. Let's see what we got. Clutch Max. Alrighty. That's nice and aggressive. Is version two. Oh yeah. So looks pretty good. That'll be perfectly fine for now. Um, when we go turbo, holds a decent 300 horsepower. I think it's 320, but. Um, Yep, we got the tools. Yeah, they should definitely do. So I'm waiting for a couple of more pieces to complete the transmission swap, and that will be coming up soon.